Welcome down to another episode of Golf's Best Offs. Today we're in Fife. We are at Ash Trufer Golf Club, 4,800 yards. It's a par 62, but more importantly, it's home to one of the hardest holes in golf. Enjoy Ash Trufer Golf Club. Right, first hole we're playing here at Hans Schroeter is a par four, 407 yard stroke five, called Cairns Road. Downwind, I've got a chance. You can just see the bridge popping its way through the fog all the way down there. Right, here we go. I think I've got you a gem here. I think I've got you a gem. Straight down the middle. Pulled a tad, but I'm having that all day long. As they say in Scotland, it's running like a scalded cat. Right, look at this here, you're gonna love this. This over there is Edinburgh. You can see Isle of May and also Edinburgh. But at the moment, that's called fog and it's just going away from the harbour and it's missing us. But I tell you something, I found one here, I found one. This is the best 25 quid golf course I played. That's top secret. If you pay an extra fiver when you finish your round, you can have fish and chips. How good's that? Right, what a drive. We've got 120 yards, but I feel like it's going to play about 110, so I'm going to gap wedge. Don't want to go bunker right. There's a green behind this green, so I think the opposite flag will be nice. Just get it up in the air, let the wind do it, I think. And look at that for a shot. That is shocking. You know the saying in golf, drive for sure, wedge play for that. I'm a bit gutted about that. Here's me thinking, because the last time I did this, I had a good game. Well, so much shouting and singing. Right, so I'm loving this series, but I want you to get involved in the comments. Like here, I've brought you for 25 quid. Where else should I go in the British Isles and Ireland, North and South? Comment below where I should go. But don't be lazy, tell me why, give me a reason. Because if you don't give me a reason, I'll probably not look it up. So don't be lazy, comment below. What a crap shot that was. Right, how's that for a view? Makes up for a bad shot then, I'm not really bothered. That's awesome. And that's not a bridge down there, we think it's a rig. This is actually a tight little nippy lie, this. I'll do well, keep this on the green. But hey ho. That might check. What a shot that was. Seriously, that was so good, I'm gonna name it. Great shot, Liam. I've got a putt for par, but again, look at this. It's well worth the money, isn't it? Well worth it. I've got a good in here. All right, we'll have the flag out. It's ran on a bit more, but I'll take that. That was an hard chip, that. So if I bet the Scottish people are looking now and said I should have just like bumped and run like a seven iron in there. Do you know old Tom Morris had a hand in this course? Years and years ago, it was a five hauler and he sold them to buy some land, and make it a nine hauler. So old Tom, that his uh, fingers in this course right for a par. Oh. Oh. Bit of knowledge and I nearly got it. Mm. Bogey, not to worry. As they say, golf's about happiness. Coming here, you'll be happy. Bogey the all, am I happy? Looking at that I am. I always get the weather. Right, here's one for you, course record. 58, George Murray, plus two handicapper. Oh, what a player, George. Right, look at this. This is called Magazine. 300 yard into wind. Don't go right. In the fourth for fourth, or fourth for fourth. I think I'm gonna try and aim left of the green, just to be safe and sorry. But I don't wanna be chipping over a house. Nothing for right. Nothing for right. Hey, that keeps fading. Don't go behind the house. Oh, it's just short of it. I think the house is behind the green. It gets nice and safe, that's more like it. Have you seen what we're gonna play next? Look at this for a golf hole. Look at this for a hole. We're gonna be playing this later on. I tell you, this, this is a nine hole course, but, but there's four par fours, five par threes, and there's one par three. It's rated as the hardest par three in all of the UK. I'm going to call it now, in the world. But wait till you see that, because the rumours it's next hole. Right, 
I'm already weighing up this Ash Shooter, it's beautiful, and you can play here too. There's a giveaway for a football, or you've got a comment, Liam, I want to play here. Good luck. Right, that drive's gone 200 yards. I need it well. Drive before that's gone about 290. Right, I've got 90 yards. I'm going to hit a 9 iron easy. Keep it low, get it over the corner of the house, and like bunt it in. None of these high shots, just going to have a baby 9. 9 normally does about 135, so an easy 9. Let's see if I've got it right now. We'll have a bit of that, won't we? Two pot, happy days. Right, I'm happy with that. Very happy. That's how I should have played the bloody uh, first hole. Right, should be a little bit right to left. It had it, it had it. I nearly did. A birdie dance here for you. For the gimme police. Pa! Right, on to the hardest par three, probably in the world. Wait till you see this. Just let you know, I'm sure it's over 256 yard and you can't see the green, I believe. Come on, let's have a look. Right, this is it, the Rockies. Par three, 246 yards, I've got it wrong. Vought is Britain's hardest par three in 2027. We'll change that because it's bloody hard. Look at this, what I've got up. As you can see with the drone, absolutely. I'm going to play off the tips and... It's what you see there. It's a slight dog left, left to right. And I cannot see the pin at all. There's the pin, so I can't see it from the white. Uh, I haven't a clue what I'm going to rate here. I won't lie to you, I feel like going to bottom of the bag and getting a spud. <laughs> right, wish me luck. Right, here we go. I'm going to go with three iron because it's downwind. And it's elevated down. So, I think it'll be enough. Them houses would be a good one, I think. It'll go with the wind if you hit it nice. That's faded. Is that going to... What a bounce that is. What a bounce. I got a nice bounce, sir. I think that'll be just left of the green, nearly pin high. You ready? I'm taking that. Because Andrew Beef Johnson of the European Tour, who's won twice, I've mentioned I've won on the European Tour as a caddy, he only bogged this, so let's see if I can try and beat a bit of beef. So why come Ash Shruto? It's dead easy. For the money, and if you're doing nine holes, if you played one of the big boys, St Andrews, Crail, Dunbarney, it's brilliant for coming here for a bit of fun. You probably get round in an hour and a half and get your fish dinner. All right, here we go, just letting someone through. A lad's just hit a driver and his line we're up on the hill and it bounced all the way down. So maybe I had the wrong line. Anyway, I didn't really hit that three iron, but look at this. I'm gonna try and hit a nine iron, chip and run, over that hill, up high, and hopefully it comes back down. I hate to say it, I'll take a ball gear. I think most people would. In fact, I believe someone's had a hole in one on this hole. There won't be many. Stay on the green. It deserves to stay on the green. It will do. It will do. It will do. Okay. Safe. I'm going to grab hold of a local and see how they play this hole because I'm making a bit of a hash in it, really, but it is hard. Hi, nice to meet you, sir. I've played here for 60 years and I've never had my ball on the green. It's so hard, isn't it? I can't reach it now because I'm too well, old. You've done what you did. when I was young. These two, Hale and Pace here, have just told me, put it up the hill and it'll roll back down to two foot and it'll be a gimme, a nice four. Yep. But I am going to have a try after the event, but thanks for that local knowledge. What nice gentlemen they are, members here. They've just told me, for a membership fee for a year, <coughs> 270 or 280 pound. Basically, it's just less than 300 quid to be a member. Any of you lads in America want to be attached to a club? Yeah. Here's your club. That's straight, that putt. I'm having it. Right, I know the local said, put it up the hill and roll it down. Uh-uh. I want to try and beat beef. Let's be sensible. I've got my sensible head on. All right, put for a par. Oh. oh. Tell you what, let's put a tee there. Let's just see anyway. Right, bogey. God, that's two over. 
Shall we try it? Let's see if you were telling the truth, that man. No, I don't think it'll work. Jesus, look at this. Wow, it would have done a bit higher. Right, what a bruiser that will. Wait till you see this next par three. Unreal. Right, this is a par three, 133 yards, size of a 50 pence piece called Congia. I've been told, aim right, and it bounces down. That looks so tricky, that. I mean, it's spectacular. So, it's weird. I've just played such a long par three, very hard. Now, this is not long, but with the wind and the waves crashing, let's have a go. It's probably getting right number. Look at that rubbish. <laughs> that is gone on the path the oh I'm totally uncommitted to that oh look at it I'm feeling this wind I don't think it's too much club too much club what a hard golf hole made even harder with that sort of tee shot I'm going to be honest that's hit there there and trickled here that shot was disgusting embarrassing probably made you laugh but you know what it's like I said in the intro doesn't matter when you're a place like that, if you get a few bad shots, who cares? But this is an hard shot now. The locals did say go right to left, but I can't see that. I can't see it holding the green. The green looks a little bit slanted, which to be fair though, the greens are absolutely, do you know what, it's nestled in a bit as well. Right, come on. It's gonna have to swing a bit, a bit juicy on this to get it up in the air. Sit, sit, stay on the green. Oh no, don't be naughty. Stay, stay, stay. It's solid, but it's fantastic fun. I'm telling you, if you've gone and played 18 holes and you want a bit of fun, come here, get your fish supper and have nine holes of uh, fun. And I mean that, just fun. And I bet you a tenner none of you will get on the Rockies hole in regulation. That is one shot. Right, cameraman's asked, can he have the pin in? So we're leaving it in. So if it hits it, it will not go in because the wind's this way. Uh, left to right, greens are phenomenal. So yeah, Greenkeeper has done a great job. Wait till I tell you there's only one of them and a little helper. Right, for a par. Got it, oh. Wow, 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 wow. Right, that is three over par now. And that nearly missed, but I tell you what, what a great little tricky all that. Long one, short one, both difficult in their own right. But very enjoyable to play. Two holes left. Right, here we go. You're gonna love this. This is called East Nuke. It's 416 yards into. This is gonna play along. What a view. Love the little castle we've got there. We're gonna finish on that, a par three. Love the view. I tell you, it reminds me of Cullen this. Uh, it does, but this, this isn't great, Nick. One green keeper, yes, comment below and give him some love. One green keeper and a sidekick now and again, but one green keeper, unreal. Right, come on, I need a, a good shot here. Best I've got, look at that. Try and get to 150 at least. Jesus Christ, chicken and rice. That got levered, that was a great swing, nothing like these. Iron shots, that was really it. I don't even think that's gone 200 yards and I absolutely munched that. Oh well, grip it and hit it again. Come on. What a view that is. Got 190 yard, got three iron. Not hit it well, but we're gonna have a go. I mean, I could hit that wood, but I just, what light is, a few houses left. So I think, give me alignment. I think we'll go with this. This should be all right. Pulled it left, it's going left of the green. It's okay, it's, I'd say it's on the other tee. That's not bad, look, it weren't the best, but it's all right, I've got a chance. Saying that I'm tripping over at Bunker. It's okay. Days like this are here for enjoyment. And remember, got the fish and chips dinner later on. Well, that fog stool there from this morning, so you can, still can't see Edinburgh or Isle of May. But anyway, look at this. This free iron weren't the best, but it's got me here. I'm gonna go my Scottish heritage, nine iron. Just try and bump it left of that bunker and it should kick it this way. 
tell you what, it's a test of golf here. As I know, I'm three over. Come on, get this up and down. Oh, that's scabby. That's disgustingly good, but bad at the same time. Listen, I'm not one for lying, but that was poo poo, and it was white poo poo, which is rare as well. <laughs> right. Putney, I mean, that was that was a terrible chip, that one, but like I said, not that bothered. In a happy place here. Right, come on, boy. I'll do it for old Tom. Yeah, oh, for God's sake, I did the old celebration. Oh, golfing God's not with me today, mind you. There's another four, that's four over par, four. Five, oh bloody haven't Joe. Cameraman, you played well. Played well yesterday. Anyway, on to the last. And it's gonna finish on this beautiful par three with that stunning castle. Right, last hole, and what a belter. In two left to right, 150. I'm actually gonna go six iron and try and start it on the castle and let it flicker in. Sounds fantastic. With the way I'm playing, I'm not too sure it's gonna happen, but we're gonna have a go. When it's breezy, swing easy. Voice is going, I bet you're glad to know that. Oh. Go. Plenty of that. <laughs> I'm here to play golf, mates. I'm here to play. Finally, a bit one good golf shot with an iron. I can finish with a par. Four over, six holes. It'll just be uh, two over what I said I was going to do. Come on, what a finishing hole this is. Look at the level of work here. Again, one greenkeeper and his mate, I think it's called Simon or Stuart. Either way, you're doing a good job. So that's six iron. Maybe a seven iron, because any more, I'm in the third for fourth. That's all, that's that blue stuff over there. What a job he's done there, that's class. Big up to the greenkeeper. When in Scotland, put it if you can. And it'd be nice, as the Scottish say, finish with a wee birdie. I don't think I've hit it. How has that got there? The speed of these greens are unreal. That was close to a miss hit, that. Wow. In a minute, when I make my par putt, I'll be in there, tartar sauce, chips and fish, all day long. To finish four over, six holes. Liam Harrison, Astruder Golf Club. Get in. Thank you for watching. Make sure you subscribe. More importantly, smash the like button. I'll be seeing you.